Hello, my awesome artists. And as you can see, guys, we're still doing hearts. We're still doing hearts in our artwork, okay? Because Valentine's Day is this weekend, everybody. So I hope that you guys have been telling the people that you love, that you love them and you care about them and you appreciate them, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and get this started. I hope everybody watched the video on the three primary color video with the uh, the three men that were on there. I hope you guys enjoyed that video from Sesame Street. We're gonna go ahead and get this started, okay? So to review, our three primary colors are what? Red, yellow, and blue, okay? Those are our three primary colors, okay guys? Then it takes two primary colors to make what? Secondary colors, okay? I hope you guys are paying attention. So, red and yellow make what? Orange, yes. Red and yellow make orange. So, red plus yellow equals orange. Next, if I take red and blue, what do you think that's gonna make? Red and blue make Purple, woohoo! Red and yellow, purple. Now, if I take yellow and blue, guess what I'm gonna get? Green! Yellow and blue, green, okay? So red and yellow, red, yellow, and blue, these are our primary colors, and it takes two of those to make secondary colors, okay? Secondary colors. These are the colors that we're going to be focusing on. Red, yellow, blue, primary, and these are our secondary colors. Orange, purple, and green, or orange, green, purple, okay? Those are our secondary colors. So, without further ado, we're going to get this party, Valentine party started, all right? I want you to start with a heart, a simple heart. We know how to draw these, right? A V with a M on top, and that encloses the shape of the heart. And we know that a shape is an element of heart, element of art, <laughs> element of heart, <laughs> element of art. You know what I'm trying to say, everybody. So this is a shape, element of art. Now, with this, because we're going to be using this to make our overlapping hearts with the primary and secondary colors, I want you guys to try to make a template. And a template is simply something that helps us draw shapes, all right? So in order to make a template, I'm just gonna start with a small piece of paper that I folded in half, and I'm gonna draw half of a heart on here. Basically, I'm drawing just this part of the of the heart, just half of it. And I'm gonna start with a shape like that, okay? And I'm drawing it on the fold. Now, I'm gonna take my scissors and I'm going to cut it out. And I make sure that I'm cutting on the fold, everybody. All right, make sure that you clean up your mess, everybody, okay? All of your little things that, that you do when you cut things out, I want you to throw them away. I want to throw mine away like a good art person, artist should. Clean up after yourselves. Now, if you guys don't have a little piece of paper to draw your heart with, that is okay. You can just free draw your heart. You all guys already know how to draw, uh, how to draw that with the V shape and the um, M on top, okay? but I'm going to use my template because I want a smaller heart than this one, okay? I'm gonna start like this. And remember guys, the project is called Overlapping Hearts. And we know that overlap means something that crosses over each other, okay? But you can still see it. Ok, 
okay? See, look, my two, lap, two hearts overlap each other and I have this little space right here, this little shape right here. So on your overlap, guys, I'm gonna color this heart a primary color. I'm gonna color this part another primary color and guess what? When they collide, psh, we got a secondary color that's gonna go right there. Do you guys can handle that? I know you can. Let's go ahead and do some more overlapping hearts. Make sure that you hold it down, you don't move it around or else your heart won't be happy. It'll be all messed up. So we gotta keep the template where it is. I guess I could do it like this, huh? What do you guys think? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So I got a primary color here, primary color there, and right in between there is the secondary color. I'm gonna do it over here too. Uh-oh, made a mistake, that's okay. Okay, let's go ahead and get to coloring. So I'm gonna start here. Okay, and as soon as this red and yellow collide with each other, I get orange. Now, down here, I'm going to do yellow and blue. Yellow and blue. And what do you think yellow and blue is going to, what's gonna happen with yellow and blue, everybody? What do you think is gonna happen? If I do yellow and blue together, If yellow and blue collide together, they're going to get green. All right, now I got one more left. I got red. I think I'm gonna do it on this side, people. What do you think? Got red and blue. Red and blue, and I'm going to get purple in this little section right here. Okay, next guys, I'm going to outline my hearts. And 
And guys, if you don't have a black marker, please use a black crayon after you color. Okay guys, and that is the primary color heart project. Hope you guys like it. See you next time.